It might look all nice sunny and pretty outside, but it's actually about 9 degrees, and that is far too cold for southern Kansas. Anyway, tonight at North Rock Lanes is the Pro-Am at the 2024 PBA Players Championship. This one was a lot more expensive than last year, but I wanted to bowl in it because this is a major championship. And on top of that, Monday's final, I'm going to be in the stands. So this should be very interesting. I'm very excited to see what happens. Let's head over there, get ready to bowl. Right, so we're here at North Rock, just turned up. Uh, championship pairs getting set, back, set up back there. Um, I'm just waiting around, waiting for everything to start, but we've already got a ton of people here. I think all the slots are filled, so this should be one hell of a night. Here they are setting up the uh, championship pair. I'm gonna be in the stands in that because I got tickets to see it live. So that's Monday at four o'clock. You guys might see me uh, in the stands, but that is gonna be exciting. And this is gonna be just as exciting. And while we wait, I got a little bit of an Arnold Palmer. Can't use a straw yet because I had my wisdom teeth pulled about two weeks ago and I still don't want to get a dry socket. I'm on lanes 43 and 44. Block 5 and Pro 10 is very descriptive, so I don't know who I'm going to be bowling with. It all happens, well, you saw my last video on a Pro-Am here. It's three different guys and they all rotate, so this should be, this should be one hell of a night, judging by how many people are here in the environment. I'm going to like this. I bowled with him last year, and uh, in fact, in Wichita last year, he was close to throwing in the towel. He hadn't won a title in forever. But look at him when he wins the Lucky Larson Masters and turns everything around. I really like this kid. AJ Johnson is underrated as hell. You guys need to check him out. All right, so the professionals are starting to roll out. We got a couple of them coming out right now. I saw Tackett earlier uh, signing a pin. There's a little bit of a photo op going over here as well, so I think I'm bowling with this guy. Two so I bowled with you last year at the Wichita Classic Front. I read, on, yeah. I read at some point that at that same tournament, you were close to what they said throwing in the towel. Why was that? Yeah, uh, I was, uh, you know. Things weren't really going my way that year, and it was just at a point like I started feeling some things that I hadn't felt in a long time, and uh, right. I had an experience. So it just was, uh, you know, I, a lot of a lot of demons, a lot of things going on, and it, I needed to uh, I needed to address, and uh, I needed to figure out a way to take care of that uh, to kind of put the season in the next week. Uh, within the next couple of weeks, I, I flipped that around and made the rest of the year pretty good. And then you win the Lucky Larson Masters, and look at you now. Yeah, exactly. Hell, hell of a run, man. I'm yeah. telling you that much. Yeah, of course. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'm not doing so hot, but I'm pretty sure it'll be turned around very soon. One twenty-four for the first game, but the first game's always an excuse to bowl like shit. I'm pretty sure I'm bowling with Thomas Larson next, and Chris Barnes is over there with Kimberly Pressler, and Kevin Williams here was making one hell of a show with these youngsters here, so. This is the best pro-am I've been to so far, and I like this place a lot. Um, just, just out of curiosity, how did you develop that, the, uh, the unique arm swing of yours with the cupped wrist and all? I think just, uh, trying to, uh, do what I grew up watching, what you guys like, so many jokes bowl to do what he did and all right. Alright, so you're like the uh, the early form of the of the YouTube bowlers, huh? Pretty much, yeah. Yep. Used, to, used to watch all the PBA guys on, on yep. TV and everything and just try to do what yep. they did. I think that's uh, similar to uh, I think Parker Bone the third based his style loosely off of Steve Cook. That's yeah. Pretty, pretty interesting. Yep. I guess you could say I'm a man on a mission. That was a fucking horrible joke. This guy is awesome. Get all ten. Hell yeah. One 
one more and she'll have a no tap three hundy. Come on, girl! Yeah! <laughs> nice, nice. Three hundy. You have a chance. The man, the myth, the legend. Chris Barnes. Hit. Yeah! Caught it in the flood in the middle of the lane and it just froze. Come on, Chris. Wow. What a night. I mean, what a night this was. You have to do that. You have to do the two kicks. Man, man what, what a night. I mean, really. Way too much fun. That was so much more fun than last year's Pro-Am. And I mean, I, I had all kinds of guys with me. So, what a night that was. Thanks for watching, guys. See you around.